Hi everyone, let's j o i n again. Today I just want to talk about the PPE. What the PPE is standing for? The PPE is standing for the personal protective equipment. What are they? They including about clothing, golf, face shield, Google, face mark, which is equipment for front line. It's not only nerd. It can. Be everyone who work in the healthcare, we always use it. As you can see, that I always wear in my ward to protecting myself. What are they protecting? When we use PPE, PPE act as a bodily to block a transmission of the infection material, from, for example, body flu, blood. When people sneeze, when we taking the blood, so this PPE can protecting us. Sometimes it's hard because of we have to wear and make it can't breathe properly. That what you can see is in the anywhere where we have it on the media. PPE may also protect high risk of the patient from get the infection material from the healthcare worker. This is both way. So, not only PPE can help with protection. The other thing that we can help with, uh, PPE together, we use a hand washer. So. Ankle g o n that we use can be help us to protect or prevent not to transmit all the infection to other people, and the PPE can minimize the spread out of the infection from one person to another person as well. So, in this case, how do I feel before I go into the infection room when I have? The patient who have a potential with a uh, COVID, or they already confirm positive COVID infection. We have to dress as the photo that I show in here. It take time to dress it, and they have a uh, what's it calling the procedure that. Which one do we wear first? So when we enter in the patient room, who confirm COVID positive or have a close contact to the positive COVID patient, we have to be very very careful, and then before we get out from the infection room, we have the. Step by step, a priority. Which one should we take off first? So you can see on the media on the protocol, in the healthcare worker that we always present in the right position because that we don't want to transmit all the infection to other people, and then we will minimize to get into the infection room because of. The more we get in the infection room, or the more we get out, it mean that we are hard list to get contact or get the COVID positive, or we spread it out to other people. So in my ward, we still have the COVID patient admit into our ward. So we. What happened because we don't have enough bed, so surgical ward or any ward have to admit patient in COVID. So we all be training how to use the PPE properly. So PPE is important. Don't ignore it, and also the hand hygiene washing. You need to wash your hand properly. So. I know that people say how many time we gonna wash it. Oh, will be a lot of time. We don't know. We never count. But again, I telling you, 
we need to comply. And this PPE, can we reuse it? We don't reuse it, all right? Because of you can be at the high risk of transmit when we use it again or wear it again. But in my world, the Coco, we have the individual, and in the common Coco, we will clean it up properly. We will reuse it, but normally, uh, in my world, we have our Coco to wear it and we put the name on. Is a PPE very useful or protective or effective for prevent? Yes, it's prevent. It is a battery. So when you see some patient already confirmed with COVID, comply and use a PPE. Use everything as it protect you and protect other people. And don't ignore it because this is a requirement especially in the COVID period time. I hope that everywhere in the world now slowing down about how to stop the COVID, but we need to live with that. We need to prevent that. As I'm a healthcare worker, I'm a nurse, I have to comply it because as you listen from my video, my husband and I and my father-in-law, we got contact. We got diagnosed with COVID positive last year on December. I'm telling you, it's not present at all. But anyway, we survive at the moment. If you are a healthcare worker, if you have a PPE, please use it because this PPE decide to be the battery to help the health care worker to prevent the infection to spread out. So PPE is important. Please use it.